All right. <laughs> um, Robert Bernowski just... <laughs> it looks like you just poured that into your coffee cup. <laughs> <laughs> is this coffee? Yeah. <laughs> Is it as a co yeah, it's coffee. Mm -hmm. Um Robert J. Barnowski. There's gonna be so many screenshots from I'm this. talking, excuse me. <laughs> no, I don't care. Asked us, do you ever have a live studio audience as in there in person? So that's an easy one. <laughs> Just Jamie. No. Yeah. Hi Jamie. We have our new videographer, <coughs> Jamie, here yes, with us today. The, uh, she's, she's back there behind Jump in there, me. Jamie. Mac, turn on your camera. So we have a new member. You gotta be not behind Max. Yeah, head. Look at the camera. So we have a new member of our team. Don't Jamie. look at the monitor. Hi, exactly. There we go. The um, but so, other than that, yeah. we don't typically. The great exception to the rule would be, if Muhammad will not go to the mountain, mountain will come to Muhammad, right? So we are Please. going to be doing a live and in-person show at the Celtic Classic Festival in beautiful downtown Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. When is that, Eric? That is September twenty-fourth, twenty twenty-two. What time is it, Eric? Right now. Uh, the showtime will be 2 o'clock in the afternoon in the Heritage Hollow. Yes, I will be putting out more blasts about this. Rocky will also. We're going to be reminding people, come join us. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a blast. We've never done this on location before. We've never had a live audience like this before. The closest we came was doing some content for, like, the, the grand reopening. Yeah. You know, and or when we had people come in the studio and just to do a tour, and we did yeah. some, you know, little video stuff. But an actual show where we actually have microphones, like, so, hey, tell us what you think. You know, or, or that kind of thing we've never done. So, it's going to be it's going to be interesting. Sat it's it's a sat is it it's, is it September 24th? It's Correct. a Saturday. Saturday. 2 o'clock, last Saturday in in September. Um yes, yep. I am excited, nervous, weirded out. Um we when we're doing this, we're just talking to a black thing in the middle of the room. Yeah. So, it's going to be fun and weird to have actual people like laughing at us. Well, you guys laugh at me all the time. I don't laugh at you all the time. Yeah. But, at yeah, me, different. more. Well, not with me, at me. But so it's that's random fine. people on the street. You know, yes, exactly. People we invited to come Point and laugh at little us. Little kids. Ha <laughs> ha. Um, a lot of Simpsons references today. Yeah. Um, oh, 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 Matt is. Now, will there be a live tasting for the audience? They're, uh, they are asking. <sighs> we weren't going to do. See, here's the thing. Yeah. Okay. We weren't going to yeah. do that part of the. Yes and Wait. no. Yes, oh. and, yes and no. Here, yep. Here's the whole thing that's happening. Um. <clears throat> right before we, we're going on at two, we are going to have a meetup around one thirty ish, somewhere in there, right. um, near the area where we're going. Because you know we have the stage for an hour, so it's like they walk off, we walk on, go. So we're gonna meet up a little bit beforehand. We're gonna have some a uh, couple bevies, um, and we do want to hang out. We do want to party. We yeah. do want to drink before and after. All day, um, but but the um, uh, at the same time, I'm trying to be respectful of the festival because they sell beer, they sell alcohol, so I want to be purchasing things from them. So bring beer that you've purchased from the festival yeah. to the little meetup thing, and then we'll all just kind of hang out, chat for a little bit. I'm gonna make sure. People have questions, so we're not just me and Eric twiddling our thumbs with crickets. <laughs> um, <clears throat> exactly. Oh, how is everybody? Indeed. All, all five of you. And then after the thing, we're going to just kind of like remove ourselves from the stage, go somewhere else, and just kind of hang out right. and chat for yeah, a little Yeah, we want to try and maximize our time, but not at the expense yeah. of the venue. We don't want to be jerks or yeah. anything like that. The Heritage Hollow, for anybody who hasn't been there, is like where all the clan tents are. And there's this one building down towards the end where there's a stage, so we're going to be using that. But there's a nice grassy area there, too, so we can basically figure we can just hang out there before and after the show. Yep. And it should be nice. So Yeah. It's going to be a good time. Um, I'm, like, weirdly excited about it. I want to Oh, it's going it. to be awesome. It's, it's going to be fun. It's, this, this is weird. This is unnatural. Speaking to weird one, two, three cameras in the middle of the room. Um, but having audience interaction, which is why we're at least thankful that we can have you guys commenting right. and giving us stuff to talk about. Um, it's, yeah, it's going to be a good I mean, time. It's, kinda, it's funny because it was now that it feels normal now because we've been doing it for so long. Yeah. But, but yeah, it was very, very odd at first. Yeah. And yet I had done public speaking before. So it was kind of like coming from that. It was just especially odd. And you've done some public speaking. I mean, we've done oh, I'm, I'm a, I am we've horrible at public speaking. Oh, bull. You did, Dude, I, you've no, done I the speeches talk... for the St. Andrews Society. I know, and I've watched the videos, and I cringe. I'm like, oh, so, blah, 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 blah. and I go like You're super fine. fast because I want to get the hell out You're of the fine. situation. And this is not a prepared speech. This is conversation. Yeah. It'll be fine. Yep. Oh, I know that. It's, Tell him it will be fine. Oh, I know it's going to be fine. The It's going to be more just this kind of BS banter and us being natural versus trying to... Mem I am not good at memorization at freaking all. 
Not at all. So yeah. this if we're gonna do something in front of a crowd, this is it. Probably should be prepared for some of the questions being pretty basic because we'll probably have a few people who are completely new to this stuff, unlike some of you folks out there. Nope. I um, want all of these people coming with all of the really, really intense questions. <laughs> we'll kick everyone else out. We're gonna bring in a steamroller and just go to town on all the grannies sitting there. <laughs> You guys are going to take the seats, and we're going to take over the entire festival. I'm gonna, yes. I'm, I'm going to imagine it's going to be like a press conference in area, like, uh, Mr. Rager, Mr. Rager, uh, when Murray of Athol uh, first entered into Glenfiddich, was he in fact wearing a weathered tartan, or was it actually a, yeah, I mean. Fine, do it. No further questions. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> it was storm off the stage. <laughs> uh, no. We want you guys out there. It's going to be fun. Yep. We want to make it more of an event than just a Q&A a, live kind and, that, of and that, that turned into a plug, which I didn't really mean it to be, but the short answer is we have not had a studio, in-studio audience here. That'll be the first time we do something like that. In the future, I would like to host people here um, in the building for, for special occasions. So yep. hopefully it'll happen. Agreed. Okay. Next. <sighs> Mr. Mac. Gonna have our in-studio six-pack. Our six-pack or six pack. pack Well, it depends on how much we want to have. And oh, okay, <laughs> okay. No, there was a radio station out in Harrisburg. They used to call it. They would bring six people in. That's what I was to say. Is that like back. an audience nickname? Uh, got so it, they got would, it, got when they would do it. There's no studio. room in this room. I mean, Jamie's like shoved behind a curtain. You might be able. They're scaffolding over there. Right. We'll make They're it like bleachers. Rafters. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, just hold it. on for two hours. Take, got, take the construction scaffold we have there and just turn it into bleachers. Seating. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Very very high tech. A double decker couch, if you will. Yes. Okay. I like. I prefer to think of them as wooden bunk beds. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Kilts and Culture is not performed in front of a live studio audience for a reason. If you want to actually see something that we do live, let us know in the comments and we'll try to have some kind of live event. If you like the kind of content that we're putting out, please subscribe to the channel.